Okay, so I had this idea about how to uh, better quantify some of the measurements uh, made on the foot and the last in uh, measuring the foot and uh, transferring those measurements to the last. Um, so the idea is to be able to take a line on the paper, if you see that this pedograph paper is divided into one inch lines, and uh, be able to transfer that to the top of the foot or the last so that I know that when I take my measurement uh, I'm taking an exactly perpendicular slice measurement through the foot or the last. Uh, what you see here on the side is a uh, it's a jig for sharpening bla uh, plane blades, I believe, that somebody made and I found in a garage sale. Um, there's probably a number of ways to uh, accomplish this same task, but what this allows me to do is uh, slide uh, the carriage left or right, and uh, while this is intended to be a fixed angle, I, I've got it loose so that I can tip it up and down. And what you see attached there is a pen laser uh, that I got from Radio Shack. And it uh, produces a light on the paper. I think you can see that. Now, if I align the edge of this jig with the paper and Hopefully it stays still there. Uh, maybe I need a little some rubber feet on that sucker. But um, I can um, take the laser on any given line here and I can align it with the line and I can, I can move it up and down and it will stay on the line. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to measure, I'm going to put my foot on the pedograph and we're going to measure. Okay, so I've, I'm going to place my foot on top of the pedograph like you might normally measure somebody. And I've placed a piece of tape on top of my foot and I'm going to take the laser and I'm going to use it to uh, denote the top where the lines come in a perpendicular sense. So actually, I've got to move this here. All right. So, starting here with this line. And come up here and I can just mark it with my marker. I go to the next line center the line on the paper and then come up here and mark it with my marker. And again I'm doing this myself, on myself, which creates its own set of problems. It's, it's much easier to do this on somebody else. So, bear with me on that aspect. Okay, and now I'm done with the laser. And I would go around and take measurements the way one might normally do so, although these are not your standard measurement points. Cutting across my mark on the top and denoting on each line what that measurement is. So, 27.5 or whatever. So, I'll have a measurement on at every point. Now, I'm able to take my last and position that on there and then basically do the same thing that is to say uh, use the laser to uh, 
make a mark on the top of the last to act as the basis of my measurement. Now, these lines aren't in any particular place, they're just at whatever increment they were and wherever the foot happened to be. Uh, but they're consistent between the last and the foot and um, this is very easy to use and I've had very good results with it so far.